Austin's Rainy Night Mystery Chapter 1 The Old Book Austin lived in a cozy apartment in San Francisco. One evening, as the storm clouds gathered and the wind began to howl, Austin discovered an old, dusty box in his attic. Inside, he found his old school English literature book. It had been years since he'd seen it, and nostalgia sparked a smile on his face. The weather outside matched the perfect setting for a night of reading, dark, cold, and rainy. Austin settled into his favorite armchair, wrapped in a warm blanket, and opened the book. The rain tapped against the window, creating a soothing rhythm. He began reading, enjoying the old stories he had once studied. Chapter 2 The Unusual Rain As Austin read, the storm outside grew fiercer. The wind howled and the rain pounded against the windows. Austin's book held his attention, and he lost track of time. Suddenly, a loud crash of thunder shook the apartment, startling him. He looked up, noticing how dark and gloomy the night had become. It felt as if the storm was trying to tell him something. Chapter 3 The Knock Halfway through the book, just as he was getting to the most interesting part of the story, there was a sudden, loud knock on the door. Austin's heart raced. He wasn't expecting anyone, and the stormy night made the situation even more unsettling. He put the book down and hesitated before approaching the door. Chapter 4 The Mystery Visitor Austin opened the door cautiously, peering into the darkness. To his surprise, there was no one there. Only the storm and the darkness greeted him. But then, on the doorstep, he noticed a small mysterious package. It was wrapped in plain brown paper and had no return address. Chapter 5 The Package Austin brought the package inside and set it on the table. The storm raged on and curiosity got the better of him. He carefully unwrapped the package. Inside was another book, older and more worn than his old school book. It was titled, The Secrets of San Francisco. Chapter 6 The Strange Book Intrigued, Austin began reading the new book. It contained stories and legends about his city, San Francisco, with many details about places he had never heard of. The stories were thrilling and mysterious making Austin wonder who had sent this book and why. Chapter 7 The Hidden Clue As he read, he found a peculiar note tucked between the pages. The note was written in a strange handwriting and read, The answer lies in the tale you cherish. Follow the path where the shadows fall. Austin was puzzled but intrigued. He wondered if the note was connected to the book he was reading, or if it was part of some elaborate prank. Chapter 8 The Investigation Begins Austin decided to investigate. He returned to his old English literature book, searching for any clues that might connect the two books. He realized that some of the stories in the old book mirrored the legends in the new one. The more he read, the more he noticed connections between the tales and real places in San Francisco. Chapter 9 The Trail of Shadows Determined to solve the mystery, Austin decided to visit the locations mentioned in the new book. He waited for the storm to subside and ventured out into the city. The night was still dark and wet, adding to the eerie atmosphere. He visited landmarks and hidden corners, following the clues from the book. Chapter 10 The Hidden Location After several hours of searching, Austin arrived at an old, abandoned library mentioned in the book. It was a creepy, forgotten place, but he was determined to uncover the truth. 
The library was dark, with dust covering the shelves and cobwebs in the corners. Chapter 11 The Unexpected Encounter While exploring the library, Austin stumbled upon a hidden room. Inside, he found a collection of old manuscripts and a diary with the same handwriting as the note in the new book. As he read through the diary, he realized it belonged to a famous author who had written about the city's secrets. Chapter 12 The Revelation The diary revealed that the author had hidden a valuable manuscript somewhere in the city. The book Austin had received was a clue to finding it. Austin felt a rush of excitement. He had uncovered part of the mystery and was getting closer to finding the hidden manuscript. Chapter 13. The Final Clue Austin deciphered the last clue from the diary and returned to his apartment, where he found a hidden compartment in the old English literature book. Inside was the manuscript, along with a letter explaining that the adventure was a test of curiosity and courage. Chapter 14. The True Meaning the letter explained that the manuscript was a gift for those who appreciated the magic of stories and the thrill of discovery. Austin felt a sense of accomplishment and satisfaction. The storm had been a backdrop for his adventure, making the experience even more memorable. Chapter 15 The Moral Austin learned that the real treasure was not the manuscript, but the journey of exploration and the joy of solving a mystery. He realized that curiosity and courage lead to unexpected and wonderful discoveries. A New Adventure With the storm having passed and the city bathed in a gentle morning light, Austin sat back in his armchair, reflecting on his adventure. He felt inspired and ready for new stories and mysteries, knowing that life's most exciting moments often come when least expected.